from the humans behind Despicable. Hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute. From the humans behind Pikmin, believe it or not, there are some characters of Pikmin where this will be, which I will tell you that. There is one from the humans behind Pikmin because so many characters from the Sea of Pets from the humans were in Pikmin as well, believe it or not. I'm gonna tell you in it later. And this is a film that I loved when I was a kid from Illumination, along with the first Minions. And that is this one, The Sea of Pets. That film was part of my childhood. I really enjoyed that film when I was younger. Hey guys, it's Allah Hanhan once again, and two days left for my 17th birthday, and welcome to another review. I'm doing for my countdown to my 17th birthday. This time is on a great movie from my childhood, The Secret Life of Pets. Let's get into the plot already. So basically the plot is, it's about a girl named Katie who wants a dog named Matt, and then a few hours later, Matt's got a new friend named Sorry guys, just a, it's such a horror coming from my best friend to kill up. I can't say it's about but then Duke came Duke came and Max is not like Duke, but then they became best friends and They went to Dark Pigman's house. No joke. Dark Pigman's house is in this show And believe it or not, there are two characters that were in Pigman, obviously <coughs> Which I'll tell you which I will tell you in a minute and that's kind of what kind of describe what the plot is. Now, guys, I'm not gonna lie. When I saw the trial for that movie, when I went to go see ICH Collision Course, I was very excited because I loved the elimination when I was a kid. And I was very excited because it looks like a fun movie. And believe it or not, I watched the TV spots when I was a kid on YouTube before seeing the movie. So that is awesome. And I, and believe now, the week that this movie came into my area, I went to the park, the theme park from Parque de Atracciones de Madrid to Nickelodeon Land. And I, this is not a time I take a picture with Chase from Paw Patrol. How awesome is that? And I went to Water Bars Pine in the following two days. And the day that this movie came out, I went to my grandma's country summer house. And so that's awesome. But next week, the next week, I saw this film in theaters with a great friend from my childhood, actor, not actor from the Amazing World of Gumball, actor, that guy who was, who was born in 2007, actor is awesome, I love Hector, believe that, I saw this film in cinemas with Hector, that no joke, I saw this film in cinemas with actor, that is awesome, I saw this film in cinemas with actor, believe that, when this movie came out, I was a big fan of Paw Patrol. How is awesome is that? Bro, my best friend Nikoda, I was a fan of Paw Patrol when this movie came out. So that is awesome. So yeah, believe not, I watched the, tri the teaser for that film and the trials for that film on YouTube. On YouTube, back in summer 2016, I said to myself, I'd seen that film in theaters after Ice Age 5, which fucked that film in the ass collision course. So, I rewatched this movie a while ago. What do you think of it? It's a very nostalgic movie from my childhood. I really loved this movie. I found this movie to be a really cute masterpiece. And I agree with my best friend Dakota. This feels a masterpiece indeed, my friend. My best friend. So the story of this movie, yeah, a copy Toy Story, but it's actually an enjoyable story. It's kind of like Toy Story, but with pets. But with pets. And the characters were great. Max is awesome. Gidget is really good. I love Gidget. Duke is really funny. I love Duke. Sweepy. Awesome character. I love Sweepy. I love Norman the hamster. Norman is awesome. I love Norman. Pops. The dog Pops. He's awesome. And Gidget the cat. The fat cat Gidget. She's great. She's a great character. I love Gidget. Who? Chloe. I mean, Chloe. Chloe the fat cat. Sorry, guys. And Chloe. She's awesome. I love Chloe the cat. The fat cat Chloe. Who agrees that this Chloe is way better than Chloe from the Fairly Appearance? Sorry for being off topic because it has nothing to do. Because as we said, that because they all had the same names. And Mel the Bulldog. He's awesome. I love Mel. We'll get to Snowball later. 
Oportunidad. This is in a joke. There were a few characters that were in Pikmin. No joke. The TV show Pikmin has a few characters. Alex, Body Sonar, is in this movie. That's right. Body Sonar, Alex, is in this movie. Olimar's best friend. Believe not. Alex is Olimar's best friend, believe it or not. He's awesome. I love Alex. Especially in Pikmin. He was outstanding in Pikmin. And Body, he's awesome. I love Body the dog. Believe not, Body's in Pikmin. That's awesome. And then we have Daniel, which is Norman's owner. Believe not, he was in Pikmin. He's a great character. I love, no I love Daniel, Olimar's second best friend. And believe it not, there were three animals that were in the Pikmin TV show as Dark Pikmin's bodies. Tutu the pig, Derek the crocodile, and Dragon the gecko. That's right, these three iconic Pikmin characters were in this movie. That is awesome, guys. I, that, that's very awesome. They're great, you see that pets. Body and Pikmin, they were incredible. And, the movie in the show. Sorry about that, but I can't say. Let's get into the best character, Snowball. <coughs> I love Snowball. Snowball is so awesome. And believe it or not, I used to have the McDonald's toys when I was a kid, when I was 10 years old. I had Matt, Duke, Chloe, Gidget, Snowball. I had these characters when I was a kid. And I still have them to this day. And believe it or not, I used to have, I had the, the key cheese from the single life of Pants back in 2019 when the sequel is still playing in theaters in my area. And believe it or not, I even used to have a Max plush toy from the sack, which is pretty awesome. And believe it or not, I did watch the toy videos from the single life of Pants in 2016. This is at a time when toy channels were awesome back then, but nowadays, they suck. And no, I'm not nostalgic time, just saying. I'm just saying that. And the climax is really awesome. Bleed out. The music for the climax is the same music they used in the Super Mario Brothers movie chase scene. So that is awesome. And also, I really love the songs like Lovely Day. I loved that song when I was a kid. Lovely Day. Bleed out. Lovely Day was actually my music bell for one minute until the bell rings back in fourth grade. That's right. Back in fourth grade or third grade. I don't remember. I think in third grade. Yeah, in third grade. In third grade. I remember now. It was in third grade. In third grade. So that is awesome. I love the sausage seed. The sausage seed is so nostalgic. And also, I love the scene where they have a, a, a wild party. I loved that part when I was a kid, a wild party scene. And I also enjoyed, let's see, what I enjoyed. I know one. I also remember the scene where, 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 how, oh, yeah, I remember where they went to. Dark Pigman's house, which is Snowball's home in Pass Body, it's Dark Pigman's house in the TV show Pigman, with the two Derek and Dragon, Dark Pigman's best friends. So, yeah. And, so, yeah, that's I, overall, guys. The Seal of Pass is a really great film from my childhood that I love to watch this movie more often. If you haven't seen this movie yet, I recommend it. I really loved that movie when I was a kid, and I still do to this day. That feels part of my childhood, this movie has a special place in my heart when I was a kid, when I was 10 years old. I give this movie a 10 out of 10. It's an amazing, brilliant masterpiece. I'm surprised to give this movie a 10 out of 10. I give it a 10 out of 10, actually. So, that's my review of Sea Life of Pets. So, yeah. <clears throat> and I really enjoy this movie. So, my next review is... Will be guessed a movie from my childhood? Yes, it's a movie from my childhood. It's from DreamWorks. It came out twice as teen. 
And that is Trolls. I can't wait to review on Trolls. That's actually my next review. I do a review on Trolls after Sea Life of Pets. So yeah, until next time, good, lovely day, lovely day.